we physicists have waited a hundred years since 1916 for this photograph. Black holes are a fascinating mysterious phenomenon that scientists have yet to fully understand. These objects exert such a strong gravitational pull that not even light can escape, making them a place where time loses all meaning. Black holes are formed where massive stars collapse in on themselves, creating an incredibly dense object. Did you know that black holes come in different types? There are three types, stellar mass black holes, intermediate mass black holes, and supermassive black holes. Stellar mass black holes weigh between 1 and 100 times the mass of the Sun, while supermassive black holes can weigh millions or even billions of times more. Intermediate mass black holes are a mystery and are believed to bridge the gap between the other two types. Black holes may seem like giant holes in space, but they are actually much more complex and mysterious. With their unimaginable gravitational pull, they act like super magnets that attract everything, even light. Scientists have used black holes to test fundamental theories ranging from general relativity to quantum physics and string theory, making them a theoretical playground. The study of black holes has opened up a new frontier of physics, but despite our understanding of them, there is still much that remains a mystery. One of the biggest questions is what happens inside a black hole, as the sheer force at work makes it impossible to predict. What is certain, however, is that if you fall into a black hole, there is no stopping, and you will feel like you are falling into an endless void. Have you ever tried compressing something into a tiny space? It's hard, right? Well, imagine an entire star with the mass of our sun collapsing into a tiny super-dense sphere. That's what a black hole is. Its gravity is so strong that it can trap light like a super-magnet, attracting everything towards it. But a black hole is not just a hole, it's actually a sphere made up of two parts, a singularity and an event horizon. Its singularity is a point with virtually infinite density, with no volume, and is attracted to everything. It's so small and dense that it defies our understanding of physics. So next time you think of a black hole, remember that it's not just an empty void, it's a super dense, mind-bending sphere that challenges everything we know about the universe. Because of their immense gravitational force, black holes are not visible to the naked eye. Scientists utilize large radio telescopes and gravitational wave detectors to study their impact on the surrounding space. The Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, LIGO, detected gravitational waves in 2015 for the first time ever, originating from the collision of two black holes that took place over 1.3 billion years ago. Researchers can detect black holes by observing how they affect their environment as they consume and superheat gas, dust, and stars, which then emit radiation detectable as a heat image. The year 2019 marked a significant milestone in black hole observation as the Event Horizon Telescope captured the first image of a black hole. The image, taken in the Virgo Galaxy Cluster which is 55 million light-years away from Earth, showed a bright ring surrounding the black hole, indicating the heat emitted by hot gas swirling around the event horizon. While black holes themselves are invisible, we can still study their impact on the surrounding universe, providing us with a unique glimpse into the enigmatic nature of these celestial objects. When it comes to black holes, curiosity naturally arises about what happens inside them. However, falling into one is not an experience you'd want to have. Regardless of whether it's a stellar mass or supermassive black hole, the outcome is bleak. Falling into a stellar mass black hole would result in a process known as spaghettification, which is as unpleasant as it sounds. But if you thought that a supermassive black hole would be a better option, think again. Although you wouldn't turn into spaghetti, you also wouldn't be able to escape its grasp. Have you ever considered the possibility of exploring the depths of a black hole? Despite the dangers, it could unlock a wealth of knowledge about the universe. The conventional idea that falling into a black hole results in being crushed into a singularity is now being challenged by a new theory called loop quantum gravity. According to this theory, matter inside a black hole could be compressed into a Planck star, the smallest possible volume, allowing us to explore a whole new realm of physics. Unlike the conventional view, 
black holes are not eternal and they may not end in a singularity. Instead, the chunkiness of space-time could prevent singularities from forming, making black holes only temporary objects. Even though it may take billions or trillions of years from our perspective for a black hole to explode, there may be wonders waiting. If you're intrigued by black holes, you're going to love Gravistars. They're a novel approach to the singularity problem that doesn't rely on unproven theories of quantum gravity. The name might sound improvised, but that's the way astronomy goes sometimes. Gravistars differ from black holes in that they contain dark energy instead of a singularity. Although this might sound like a concept from science fiction, dark energy is a real phenomenon that exists and causes the universe to expand. Gravistars are a fascinating alternative to black holes, offering a solution to the singularity problem without resorting to unproven quantum gravity theories. Instead of a singularity, they are filled with dark energy, a real substance that contributes to the universe's expansion. Matter falling onto a gravistar gets trapped on its surface by the dark energy, much like the event horizon of a black hole. Although gravistars behave similarly to black holes, their existence has been called into question by recent observations from gravitational wave detectors. While they are not officially disproven, gravistars are currently on uncertain ground. Regardless, their name is undeniably cool, just like Planck stars. Moreover, there is an alternative theory that provides a less dramatic explanation for the existence of singularities. This theory is based on a more realistic perspective of black holes. Black holes are not as mundane as we once believed, they have distinct characteristics, particularly when they rotate. Rotating black holes distort the singularity into a loop, and following Einstein's theory, traversing it might lead to a wormhole and open up a completely new region of the universe. The issue with spinning black holes is their instability, and the calculations that predict wormholes also lead to the possibility of traveling to other universes. The centrifugal force produced by a rotation acts as anti-gravity and forms an inner horizon within the black hole. While radiation is falling inward towards the singularity from the outside region, the central frugal force pushes radiation close to the ring singularity, creating a wall of immensely energetic radiation. Despite their peculiar nature, spinning black holes are real, and recent gravitational wave observations have allowed us to gain a better understanding of what's occurring inside them. Thankfully, a significant discovery has been made that may assist us in comprehending the consequences of black hole collisions. In 2015, gravitational waves were discovered. These are ripples in the fabric of space-time that occur when black holes merge. Scientists have used this discovery to detect nearly 100 newly formed black holes and to study the waves they produce. It's similar to shaking a box and attempting to deduce its contents based on the sounds it produces. However, in this situation, the shaking represents the collision of two black holes, and the sound is the study of the gravitational waves they generate. Through analyzing gravitational waves, researchers have made great strides in enhancing their comprehension of cosmic events and, in turn, enhancing their ability to chart the structure of what's occurring inside these events and also testing the theory of general relativity in extreme environments. Recently, nonlinear interactions research has shown promise in improving these models by as much as 10% and could lead to the discovery of even more colliding black holes in the future. This represents an important milestone in expanding our knowledge of gravity and the astonishing occurrences taking place in distant corners of the universe. Due to the pandemic, the LIGO Observatory that discovered gravitational waves has been inactive since 2020. However, new systems are scheduled to come online in the near future, allowing for greater detail and the detection of more black holes. Black holes have always been one of the most enigmatic phenomena in the universe, and a recent study from the University of Michigan has only increased their intrigue. The University of Michigan researchers have proposed an intriguing idea that could shed light on the nature of black holes. They suggest that black holes might be holograms, but not in the way one might initially assume. Rather, the researchers are using holograms as a tool to investigate the connection between the interior and exterior of black holes. The study, headed by Enrico Rinaldi, delves into the concept of holographic duality, 
which posits that the theories of gravity and particles are mathematically interchangeable. The concept of holographic duality sheds light on the discrepancy between the calculation of the exterior and the interior of black holes, which both exist in three dimensions but are not calculated the same way. This concept is relevant to understanding how black holes function and could help unravel more mysteries about these fascinating celestial bodies. Enrico Rinaldi's study explores this concept, which suggests that the theories of gravity and particles are mathematically equivalent, and uses holograms to understand the connection between the inside and outside of black holes. Please share your reflections in the comments on what intrigues you most about black holes.